Okay, now that I just made a complete idiot of myself. Hi guys, it is Wednesday morning. And it's been an eventful morning. As you can see, I'm rather burnt. Um, I'm tanning. Um, because I'm pale as shit and I don't like being pale as shit anymore because it's warm out. It's starting to get warm. Um, I just got back from a meeting with my other advisor and, uh, I just found out I got kicked out of my film class, but I didn't know that. So I was short like three credit hours. And so I signed up for this film and distributions thing and... Now I'm really pissed because I wanted to take Cinematography 1, but I am on the wait list now, so let's see if that happens. Um, oh, what I really wanted to talk about today. The Glamour Kills presale. Uh, buying I Feel Like Dancing on iTunes. Not harassing radio DJs. And uh, just the Hustle Club in general. Okay, here we go. Number one. Glimmery Kills presale is still, I'm pretty sure, still going on. Um, I got mine yesterday. I wasn't going to get one, and then my mom called me, and she's like, Do you want a Glimmer Kills presale? And I was like, Yeah. Even though I pre I already pre-ordered it um, with my bundle for with my Baltimore ticket. So go get your presale if you want. There's a deluxe version and a regular version, which I'm sure you all know about by now. Um, I, there are only two shirts I really liked, and I got the one with all the album names on it, because I felt like that was just relevant, so I got that one. Um, and then, the I Feel Like Dancing is on iTunes, which I haven't bought yet, I'll even come forth and admit that I have it illegally, because I don't have any money on my iTunes right now, I'm sorry guys, I'll get it eventually, just, I bought two copies of the album, it, I, I hope you don't hate me. Um... Go get the single. Uh, Alex said that if they get top 10, he'll leak Paper Moon. I don't know if anybody caught that. Um, I want to hear Paper Moon, so get it to top 10, guys. Um, what else? Oh, don't harass the damn 92.3 radio station that said that All Time Low were an emo version of Big Time Rush. And they... Just just leave it alone. I know that they offended the majority of the fan base, and I know that they fucked with people they shouldn't have fucked with, but if we blow this out of proportion, people are just going to think that we're more crazy than they already think we are. And I'm tired of having to explain people why we're not crazy, so can we just calm down? Um, so don't email the people with hate or call them and, I mean, I called them and played I Feel Like Dancing for like two seconds, so it's, I, I understand that was funny, but I'm not going to email them, because they don't care what I, they obviously don't care what we think, if they're going to be dicks about it, so, uh, and it's one DJ's opinion, so let's just all calm down, okay, let's just all breathe, act like mature, respectable adults here, uh, <laughs> Um, oh, what else was it? Oh, the Hustle Club. Um, I've been getting a lot of messages about meet and greet and early entry forms. Regard, like, if you have meet and greet or early entry, you have to sign out the form for both. Make, just make sure you sign out the form. Uh, I'm still working on the commercial. Actually, Beth just sent me a list the other day. I think she emailed it to me, and I have to go through the videos. Do all that finding good fun stuff. Um, this right here is my final schedule for finals, and I have a lot of crap I gotta get done by May. So, uh, yeah. But as always, my dirty work dates are gonna be like my vacation within the chaos. So on April twenty eighth, thirtieth, and May. So, oh, I almost forgot to tell you guys. But on April twentieth and thirtieth, come say hi, hang out, let's have fun and. Do lots of dirty things. Um, on May, the day of hometown, I will be getting to Baltimore the Friday. Like, Friday afternoon-ish. And, um, it was brought up last night. I brought up the idea of, like, a dinner, like, a nice dinner. So, if you're going to be in Baltimore or wherever the hell the venue is, I don't even know if it's in Baltimore. I just say Baltimore because I'm not from Maryland. So, if you're going to be there... I think that we should all get dressed up and go out to dinner, and we can be all be each other's dates. Except I already have a date, and it's Casey, but, um, I'm gonna be there Friday, and if you're gonna be there Friday or Saturday, like, before the show, like, 
please let's just hang out because Baltimore hometown shows is like seriously the only time that I feel completely enveloped and happy and carefree and I just want to feel that again and it's great. It's like heroin. Um, so yeah, Baltimore's gonna be fun. I'm so fucking pumped and um that's all I really have to say for right now because I have class in about an hour and I have to go mail all this crap they said I was mailing yesterday that I didn't mail out. So I'm gonna go mail it. I do why am I doing this? I, I don't okay, well I'm going now. Check out this awesome necklace that my mommy bought me. Hold on. It's cute. I feel like Miley would wear it. Except it has butterflies on it and she hates butterflies, but Look! Okay. Oh, time for me to go now. I'll see you guys later. If you have any questions, um, send me a PM. I don't know. Don't forget to post your dirty work stories, please. Bye, guys.